to show you how to uh, edit Skyrim NPCs with Skyrim NPC Editor and um, this mod has been rather popular lately uh, a lot of modders use it to uh, make manageable uh, NPCs and stuff <coughs> and um, it's it's the best NPC mod that's out there if I think it might be the only one uh, at least it's the best right now because uh, construction tool set is not out yet so yeah Okay, I'm I'm at the uh, Skyrim Nexus home page, and it should be here. I'll just add a link to the bottom. Uh, they recently updated to 5.2, and they added the option to load your edited ESP file. Go ahead and download it, and they fix the uh, save uh, several bugs in the mod. I already downloaded it, and I've extracted it to my desktop. Open it up. It should load up. Um, all right, I'm gonna go ahead and load from my uh, file that I've edited, which is Ayla the Huntress. And race is grayed out by default because changing the race uh, can cause crashes and stuff. It's unstable. Um, I don't know if the modder is plan planning to. Uh, add that later on but we'll see class I kept her as a trainer marksman expert um, her voice uh, I kept the same because last time I changed it before the update um, she w when she talked it was just text that uh, were displayed and she wasn't talking to me at all and the texts were going rather fast um, combat style <coughs> I have the CS Atronach Frost. <coughs> Sorry. Um, you can change this to others like uh, Dragon, Droger, and stuff like that. I didn't mess with the Crime Faction because if you do, you'll break uh, her NPC place thing because she's um she's part of the Companions. Uh, default outfit didn't mess with that. Sleeping outfit didn't mess with that. Stance you can change to normal. Uh, there's the warrior stance where you're more like hunched over and warrior like but I changed it to normal aggression they fixed uh, last time if you set it to aggressive they'll attack you now it's all um, fixed up and you gotta have it to set to either aggressive very aggressive frenzied uh, I recommend aggressive because they'll attack whatever you attack um, confidence I left that brave there's foolhardy Average, cautious, and cowardly. Cowardly, they just run from the battle. You could change their energy. Mortality, set it to no crimes. Um, that's what I'd have. Mood, you can change. I have it set to neutral. It can make her sad, happy, surprised. Uh, let's do happy. Alliances, you can do friends and allies. Um, I left it at allies. Auto level, I changed to on. I think by default, set to on for Ayla. But you can change the essentials to on or off set it on uh, loot corpse is grayed out now because uh, in version 5.0 it um, it caused their lips to uh, not move when they were talking <coughs> now on skills you can skills is just you can change it uh, the max is 100 I think uh, other than that I don't think it'll it really affect anything in game uh, factions I don't mess with this so don't ask me questions about it because I don't really want to mess with it. Um, inventory, you can add things uh, and take away things too. So you can delete here. Spells, I've already added spells of mine. Got Ice Storm, Incinerate, Flames, Heal Other, Healing, Frost All, Frostbite. You can change their appearance. Um, you can change their uh, head, which I really like uh, about this mod. I'm going to change your head to uh, Sapphire's head. Because I've been wanting to, uh, you know, have my person marry Sapphire, but couldn't. Um, I'm gonna change. Yeah, I'm just gonna leave that alone. Uh, but Ayla has a war paint, and the war paint will stay on, but uh, it'll have other Sapphire's other features. So yeah, um, there's the AI packs. I don't pants with this either, so don't mess with it. Uh, you go to create mod local C files 
or sorry for you guys to be somewhere else uh, but you want to go to your steam um, Skyrim's data folder and save it there and it'll automatically make a mesh file for you <coughs> now the problem with this is when you go back and load your file from Ailey the Huntress the appearance will be set to head so the head will be resetted to Ayla the Huntress so you gotta change that back and also for me but this might be for you too when you uh, launch Elder Scrolls right after you make the NPC, NPC um, it tends to not uh, go into effect so you wanna go to your Skyrim your Skyrim launcher or Nexus and go to data files check and uncheck or uncheck Ayla the Huntress and check it again okay exit and go ahead and launch the game uh, I'll see you guys in game alright so um I'm at the uh I'm from uh I'm at Rit Riften in front of the Temple Mara and this is Ayla and sh I mean she does pretty much the she has the same uh, hairstyle and everything uh with Sapphire except for war paint and I'm gonna go look for a bot to remove that from her um yeah, and to show you guys, she does fight with her spells. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and spawn some bandits. Now wait, this is a surprise. She uses uh, the spells. That's the last of them. So that she has. See, she's using conjure from the other. If you're looking for anything to sell for a fair price, I run the yep. pawn uh, If you have any questions or need help, Hello, comment below. Um, man to do for again, you if you do things that uh, I, don't know. I did not you recommend you do, around, and you're asking help from me, if you're ever in the market, I'm probably not going to be able to help you out. Goods for more, we didn't want to yeah, so if you. Yep. Yeah, um, bye.